Wow, what a nice day it is out here. I'm so happy it's finally summer. Does anyone else smell something burning? Whoa, did you put on sunscreen today? I don't think I need sunscreen. Actually, sunscreen is important in order to enjoy yourself on a sunny day. When the sun is shining, it emits ultraviolet rays, also known as UV rays, that are responsible for giving us a nice summer tan. There are two different types of UV rays. UVA has a long wavelength and is associated with skin aging. UVB has a shorter wavelength and is associated with skin burning. While in the sun for a long period of time, more UV rays can affect your skin, resulting in sunburns and wrinkly skin. And that's why sunscreen is here, to make sure you're covered. Sunscreen comes in different forms, from lotions to sprays. Both offer great protection from UV rays. The SPF, or sun protection factor, on the sunscreen label is a measure of how protective the sunscreen is. The higher the number, the more protection. Make sure to protect all areas that are not covered by clothing, including your face, arms, shoulders, and legs. Reapply every two hours while outside. Some sunscreens deflect UV rays like a mirror while others absorb them. Now it's time for a fun demonstration showing the importance of sunscreen. Here's what you'll need. At least two types of sunscreen, a paintbrush, construction paper, a pair of scissors, a paper plate, and a marker. To simulate the power of sunscreen, we're going to use paper, which will bleach in the sun normally. The goal of this experiment is to see how effective different SPF sunscreens are and to see what happens to our control, which will have no sunscreen. Start by putting a small amount of sunscreen onto a plate. Then, using your brush, paint your sunscreen creation onto the paper. We are going to repeat this procedure using higher SPFs. With your marker, write what SPF belongs to what piece of paper. Once dry, with the supervision of an adult, carefully cut out your sunscreen creation. Let your sunscreen painting sit out in the sun for approximately three hours. Our sunscreen paintings have been out for quite a while. Let's see how they're doing. It appears the higher SPF sunscreen protected our paper the most, while the control got bleached by the sun. I will make sure to protect my skin with sunscreen every time I'm outside. <laughs>